na maisi pa mangusap para kay para kay Bob ni Ludi wala pa ho meron pa ho bang iba at uh, Betty <coughs> ni kuna konti lang Here's something for Bob. sa mga meron po ba mga kamag-anak na magsasalita ng isang maigsi o mahabang pangungusap pwede ho nyo habaan kung gusto nyo pang habaan mamaya pa naman ang libing eh hindi ho naman aalis si Bob para mag ano eh para hintayin ho tayo magsalita ng mga pangungusap pa natin okay lang Bob ha Ayan, okay lang daw boy Okay. Wala na, wala na ba? Uh, si Early. Ah, hindi pa. Ah, Anton, okay. Boy, I am Anton Nasho. Ako yung malaking panganay na kapatid ni Ito Roy. Si Ronald Nasho. I am here in behalf of my family. My father, my brother, and sister. I really haven't spent 
a lot of time with Uncle Bob. But during the time that I the time that I spent with him, what I remember is he's my uncle who looks like Sarton Nesma. <laughs> so he, he's my uncle who likes to have a lot of fun. He loves to sing, loves to dance, and loves and likes to have drinks with my uncles, with the boys, and with the juniors, and with the so that's how I remember Apple Bob. He's um, fun to be with, he's kind, and he's just a talent. I but that's what I remember. Oh, when I'm going to go to the house, I'm going to go to the on behalf of the family of the family, Lefty, Randy, uh, Maru, Lisa, uh, Don, and all my grandchildren, uh, I'd like to share something with you. Uh, when I was in the United States with uh, Bob, that was the 2004, December, uh, we were together for about five days. And, uh, I know why he is, he's a good guy, a down to earth man, and uh, he's always discussing with me about his wife, and of course he mentioned him Junior and Alice, and of course Andrew. So there was a lot of fun during that time in New Jersey, and I never thought that uh, Bob, um, with his body, will get sick. So when we were informed that he was sick, we were wondering uh, what the sickness was. So it came to a point that uh, it's the usual sickness also that we have here in the Philippines, and that is pneumonia. However, uh, we don't have to worry about it. It's now on the other side of the place, on the other side of the fence, and that is the side of the Lord. As the priest says, uh, Death is permanent. And as we are graduating during our years, uh, elementary, high school, and uh, college, we always say it's the commencement exercise. Imagine it's the end, but we say it's the commencement. It's the beginning. So today is the beginning of a new life or back. Uh, he might not be here with us today and the rest, but we all know that he will always be with the Lord. And I could always remember that as long as we are with the Lord, we will always pray, for prayer is the greatest foundation of life. Uh, on prayer, the time will be delayed, the manner will be unexpected. But the answer is sure to come. Not a breath of holy desire poured out to God will ever be lost. But in God's own time, will be walked at back again in the clouds of mercy and for those whom you pray. Let nothing frighten thee. So, Bob was never frightened. He knows that in his end, he will always be the Lord. So to Bob, the grieving widow, and the rest of the family, let us pray that God that Bob will be with God forever. Meron pa ho ba gusto magsalita bago ho ako magsalita? Meron ho ba? Kasi ho mas mahaba sa akin kaya gusto ko hong uh, bigyan kayo ng panahon pa makapagsalita. Ayun, kailangan mo tayo masayaan ni ho ba? Sapagat ang uh, ibig sabihin ng Iiwanan tayo ng ating mahal sa buhay. Hindi ho yun dapat tayo ay maging malungkot. Do, talaga lang tama na tayo ay malungkot. Papatayin ko muna itong aking kamerahal.